McDonald's has agreed to sell a majority of its China and Hong Kong business to the state-backed conglomerate Citic Limited and Carlyle Group for up to $2.1 billion. Now, if you're wondering, why would McDonald's do this? Well, McDonald's looking to expand rapidly without using much of its own money. In a breakdown of the deal, it's a 20-year agreement, 20 years, where local partners would help speed up the growth in the world's number two economy with new restaurant openings, mostly in smaller cities that are expected to benefit from urbanization as well as growing incomes. Hong Kong-listed Citic Limited will own about 32% of the business, with Citic Capital, an affiliate company that manages private equity funds and other alternative assets, holding another 20%. Carlisle will control 28% of the business, while McDonald's will retain a 20% stake. The company said this in a statement today. Now, the deal will be settled in both cash and in shares of the new company that will act as the master franchisee for the 20-year period. McDonald's has more than 2,400 restaurants in mainland China and roughly 240 in Hong Kong. Now this new partnership plans to add 1,500 in the two areas over the next five years alone. The partnership will also aim to boost sales at existing McDonald's with menu innovation as a key focus. Fast food companies including McDonald's and Yum Brands Incorporated recovering from a series of food supply scandals in China that have helped undermine their performance. For Modern Wall Street, I'm James Swinney.